All right, so we're gonna be doing a reverse inchworm. You're gonna want a valve slide or something to reduce the friction to let your legs slide back and forth. Worst case scenario, you can use your socks on the ground, but you will have to walk your feet back up towards you as opposed to just sliding back and forth. You'll see what I mean. We're gonna start in a push-up position, and then you're just going to pike your hips up towards the ceiling, and then slowly extend back out and perform for a desired number of reps. Now what you don't want to do is you don't want to let your back sag down to the ground and feel this in your back. You should keep your abs tucked, hips tucked. You should feel it in your abs the whole entire time as you keep the ground pushed away from you, nice and tall in that push-up position, sliding your legs forward and backwards. Perform for desired number of reps.